Uh, I'm, I'm a journalist from England. Can I just ask you a couple of questions? Um, obviously, we know there's a problem here. Uh, lawsuits are being made against the state of Israel, judges, social workers, everybody. There's billions and billions of dollars of lawsuits being launched against the country by fathers, mothers and children. The UN is getting complaints every single day from our civil society and from people. What is going to happen? There's people dying every day. I will be as simple as it. Yeah. I believe in this seat, mm -hmm. for in the next few months, we're going to change the law because today the law is speaking about equal. The, the, the problem is that nobody is uh, understand the law right. The court tried to take it a different direction. What we're going to do is to make it simple and clear that it's supposed to be equal between men and uh, women, okay. they decided to break their life. The kids cannot be hurt. Not the parents and not the kids. They need to continue to step together in the same road because nobody have the right, no courts and no friends of mine in this Knesset to break the law between parents to kids and the opposite. What we're going to do is to clear one thing. Family doesn't, it's not a thing that you write by court. Family is the thing that people feel inside. If a kid wants to be close to his father, nobody has a right to stop it. If a daughter wants to be close to her mother, nobody has the right to stop it. This is what we need to do. We so need can, to hear them. Can I ask you, the tender, years, the tender Years Clause, which I was, I, I actually went to Geneva for that purpose, personally, um, was the UN said to abolish it. That was six years ago. It's still not been abolished. 2.5 is still standing. It's still not working. What about the law of six and under and the law of 2.5? Every time people tell me from the Knesset, yeah, 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 these I men are be, still I dying be, every single I, I day. It's easy, easy for me to answer you. I'm, yeah. I'm not here for, for many years. I, I know. came here one year and a half ago. Okay. For those few months that I'm here, I make a big change, even with those things. I just a few minutes ago, I gave those guys a promise, and this lady a promise, that yeah. I can do the best I can to vote for the right thing. And the right thing is to continue make clear that family is a thing that lives forever. This is my job and this is what I'm going to do. How do you feel about the fact that millions of people around the world are watching what's happening to the Israelis inside and they're in shock? Nobody is standing in the stand of us. Nobody can understand that. Nobody deal with the reality that we deal. Nobody have the problems with terror and with hateness all over the world. People, it's easier to people to see the, uh, the other side of the sea, the other side of the world and criticize us. People need to understand, if you want to live our reality, take yourself, come here and watch. I'm not talking about the reality of the territory, I'm talking about the reality the of domestic law. Exactly, How does domestic exactly, law fit into the Palestinian?